encouragement to everyone. And I just want to tell everyone today that you guys are awesome. You're beautiful. You're lovely. You're worth every effort and time and um, energy that you put into yourself and your life. You're worth that shit. You know, you know, like there's so many um things that happen in life. A lot of people, to all of us. I'm not gonna say it's a lot of people. I'm not gonna exclude myself. To so all of us, to everyone. You know, everyone has a story to tell. There's so many um. There's so many stories out here. People lie. We could write books. We could all write probably a fucking book. But you know what um. I say that to say this, that no matter what you've been through in your life, no matter what you're going through, or no matter what has happened to you, or um, what someone did to you, whatever experience that you had that maybe was not positive at all, that does not make you. It does not make you, you know? A lot of times people say, well, I'm, I'm glad it's happening because it made me who I am and everything. But a lot of like, sometimes negative things that happen in people's lives, it makes them bitter. And that's really not who you're supposed to be. You're not supposed to be bitter. You're not supposed to be unforgiving. You're not supposed to um, um, feel victimized. That's not what life's about. But there's situations in life that will make a person feel that way, you know, and that's just understandable, you know, that, that happens in life, but that doesn't mean that's who you're supposed to be, and that's not, that doesn't mean that's, that's who you are, you know, if you think about it, right, when you, like, well, for those who probably didn't have, I guess, such a bad childhood, you know, or, or before, probably shit probably happened bad in your childhood, you could probably remember probably a time where there was innocence, and where you had your innocence, and you didn't experience any bad shit in your life. Now, that person that you were before all that negative shit, that's who you really are. That's who you really are. Even though, even though you weren't, you're not a daughter, you weren't a daughter, you weren't mature yet. That's who you really are because that childlike innocence is really who a person is before everything else in life hits them. If we can all just get back to our innocence of who we really are, you know, and the things that we love to do when we were children, when we were kids, the things that um, we always dreamed of, the things that we always wanted to do, and our goals, and, you know, the positive, happy things, you know, we can get back to that, um, we'll be a lot happier in our lives, and we'll really probably get back to the essence of our true self, I think everything starts off when you're younger, when you're a child, when you're a kid, when you had your innocence, you know, before other shit, you know, happened in your life, you know. But yeah, I just want to tell everyone that you're awesome, you're beautiful, and don't let anybody or anything tell you anything different than that, no matter what happened in your life, or no matter what you're going through, you're still fucking awesome. If you're here today, that means you're here for a purpose.